Well, skipping into the boxing ring is Scotland's Rhys Lynch making his way towards the red corner. It's time to greet the boxer fighting out of the blue corner from the Republic of Kazakhstan, Sanat Ali Del Taye. His opponent is Sanat Ali Toltaev of Kazakhstan. So Reese Lynch already up in the boxing ring, awaiting the arrival of Toltaev. So our referee, Jennifer Huggins, just che checking the equipment of both boxers. She sends them back to their respective corners as we prepare to get this quarter-final underway. We're in the 63.5 kilogram light welterweight division and there's a quarter-final matchup between boxers from Scotland and Kazakhstan. The tall southpaw wearing red is Reese Lynch, 20 years of age, from Faldhouse, the Spring Hill Boxing Club. Up in Scotland, scores with a left cross against the man in blue edging forwards out of the orthodox dance and that is Sanatali Toltaev, 21 years of age. Scotland sending six men to the World Championships here in Belgrade as Reese Lynch again scoring with a long raking southpaw left, having real success with shots at long range against Toltaev. And of the six men that they sent through, to the World Championships, Reese Lynch, the only quarter finalist. Beautiful punch picking as the feet tangle between the Orthodox and Southpaw boxer, but Reese Lynch picking his punches very effectively indeed. As for Tal Taev, he one of 10 Kazakhstan quarter finalists of the 13 men they sent to box here at the World Champs, one in each of the weight divisions. Bolo left hand wasn't too far away from Reese Lynch. Toltaev trying to edge his way forward into range. Toltaev spoken to about rabbit punching around the rear of the head. Midpoint of the opening round. Straight left hand to the body wasn't too far away. Left jab of Toltaev suggests that he's getting closer as he lands with a right cross as well. Reese Lynch coming forward behind a reverse one two but didn't fully commit or find the range. Toltaev looking to burrow away on the inside and scores with a good left hook, good lateral movement, dodging left and right from Reese Lynch and what a left hand straight down the pipe in between the gloves of Toltaev. Toltaev comes back with straight shot success of his own, bulldozes Lynch back towards his own corner. Reese Lynch walk it, walks his man back out to center ring. Toltaev looking for hooks at mid range, tries a spearing lead right hand, did get through with the second one. Reddening beneath the right eye of Toltaev as he takes another stiff single from the man in red. And that's a beautiful one-two combination again. The eye-catching left cross scored by the man in red. Roughhouse tactics employed by Toltaev taking the heel of his glove and pushing it into the face of Reese Lynch. Driving his way forwards once again is Toltaev burrowing away with punches to the body. Reese Lynch trying to tie his man up. Closing seconds of the opening round. Reese Lynch operating on the back foot, takes a solid shot as he was going in search of Toltaev. Some clear punch picking from Reese Lynch, that left hand not too far away, but driving forwards, which can often impress the judges, is Toltaev digging away with the right hand to both body and head to conclude the round is Sanatali Toltaev. Very good round of boxing. Craig McAvoy up into the ring to remove the mouthpiece and issue the instructions. I think this man has done enough 
to take the first round, but how will the judges see it? And there's confirmation of a clean sweep of the cards in favor of Reese Lynch of Scotland. 10-9 for all five scoring judges. So some of the action then from the opening round. Reese Lynch finding his range immediately and turning his attributes of length and reach and range into assets, making Tol Taev fall short of the mark repeatedly and keeping him at bay with some wonderful punch picking. There was a notable southpaw left right down the middle. That was it there, which he used to terrific effect. Oh, what a left hand. Well, it's been ruled a slip, but the feet may have tangled between the orthodox and southpaw boxer, but look at the left hand success from the southpaw in red once again. And there's the same shot once more. Skedaddling out of the corner is Reese Lynch, but he's going from corner to corner. And that's why he changes direction, but he's being pinned to the ropes by the pressure being applied by Sanatoly Toltaev who conceded the opening round for all five scoring judges. And Toltaev swinging away with that right hand while looking to tie up Reese Lynch with his left. At the 2019 edition of the Asian Continental Championships as Reese Lynch goes to work with the South Pole left once again. Toltaev claimed a bronze medal place on the rostrum. Two-time national champion of Kazakhstan is Toltaev as he has success with the left hand on the inside. Reese Lynch looking to re-establish the distance between himself and his opponent. Continuing to press is Toltaev. That's a beautifully picked right cross by the boxer from Kazakhstan. He was countered by a right jab as Reese Lynch got himself back to ring center. Retreating to Toltaev's corner, there's another solid right cross. Reese Lynch gets his payback with a right-left combination of his own. But Toltaev getting closer now and now looking to target the long, lean torso of Reese Lynch midway through the second round and Toltaev put on the end of another southpaw left there but he's responding as you would expect him to swept in the opening round as the two boxes exchanging hooks from the left hand just a bit of a baleful stare exchange between the two of them right jab not too far away from Reese Lynch Toltaev edging forwards but pays a heavy price in the form of a right left combination success once again Toltaev burrowing away with punches to the body Reese Lynch came back with a single body shot of his own terrific right left from Reese Lynch but it was countered by a right hand from Toltaev who continues to press and apply the pressure he's got Reese Lynch pinned in the neutral corner worked away to the body with a couple of good punches just above the belt line of the man in red there's a left cross out of the corner from Lynch then his accuracy decreased in his work as he takes a rabbit punch from Toltaev Closing 30 seconds of the second round. Toltaev continuing to bang away with that backhand. There he scores with a jolting left. Reese Lynch keeping his composure and scores with a southpaw right and left. As Toltaev working away on the command of break. But the referee speaking to him about he, the fact he must keep his head up. So closing seconds of this second round. It's been a magnificent response by Sanatoly Toltaev. But Reese Lynch has kept his composure and had his successes also. Good right hand on the bell, lands by the man in blue. Terrific fight back by Sanatoly Toltaev. Mike Keane on the perimeter of the boxing ring with that ice pack on the rear of the neck. Craig McAvoy, the Scotland Boxing Performance Director, behind the face covering in the ring with the final instructions. Well, it's a fantastic fight back, and Toltaev crucially has taken it for three of the five scoring judges. For, for, judges, so, for, for judges two, three, and four, it is all square, 19 points apiece, because the man in blue responded magnificently, really went after his man, had success with right hands such as that, and crucially, from the Kazakhstan boxer's perspective, the fact that he has taken it on a 3-2 split means that it is all square, 19 points apiece on the card of those three judges as we go into the third and final round. So it has come down to a three-minute mini contest between Reese Lynch of Scotland and Sanatoly Toltaev of Kazakhstan. Reese Lynch with some beautiful boxing 
where he used a southpaw left like that to take the first round. 10-9 for all five scoring judges. As you would expect from a two-time national champion of Kazakhstan, Toltaev responded brilliantly in the second round, find the range, found the range with his own right hand and took the second round on a 3-2 split to tie things up for judges two, three and four, meaning that for those three judges, it is all square. And remember, you need an absolute majority of five scoring judges. 2-1 or 2-0 is not enough in the event that we have tied scores. So, minute gone in this final round. Rhys Lynch, a four-time Scottish national champion, having taken two junior and two youth titles. Good footwork there after a two-shot success. The left cross not too far away. And Toltaev working away to the body when it was in close. There he gets through with a right hand. That body work cannot be discounted. Both men need some accuracy and quality now. And that left cross coming right on cue may have been partially deflected by the gloves. As Toltaev getting rough on the inside. Oh, and that's naughty from Reese Lynch, who was knocking away. Excuse me, from Toltaev, who was knocking away on the rear of the man's head. On the way down to the canvas. So beyond the mid-stage of the third and final round, this contest on a knife edge. That's a beautiful counter right hand from Toltaev. Left jab success from Toltaev. Left uppercut wasn't too far away in response. What a body shot. Now, was that on a break? It doubled over Reese Lynch from Toltaev. He whipped in that right hand just above the belt line and it brought about a response. Is Reese Lynch still feeling the effects of that? He's still moving freely enough, but Toltaev bulldozed him to the ropes once again and working away with that right hand. Scored both downstairs and upstairs. Reese Lynch off the mark with his attempted two shot combinations. Somebody has got to find some quality here. Reese Lynch going in search of it. There he produced it with a left hand down the pipe behind the right jab. But Toltaev comes back. Body shot success from Reese Lynch is countered by a shot upstairs from Toltaev. Toltaev helping himself to a body shot as the referee intervenes. Exchange of jabs. Reese Lynch feeling the effects of this contest. Being driven backwards by Toltaev. He looks to hold on while Toltaev is looking to work away. Right jab success from Reese Lynch. Toltaev continuing to press. Reese Lynch looking for a left cross. Scores with a single, does the man from Scotland in red. And the marauding forwards once again is Toltaev. Reese Lynch firing back, and both boxers think they have done enough. High fives over in that blue corner from Mike Keane and Craig McAvoy. Slightly more subdued in the Kazakhstan boxers corner. Now remember, for judges two, three, and four, it was all square, 19 points apiece. Reese Lynch thinks that he has done enough. If we hear the word unanimous, as we see that sportsmanship between the two, then it will be Reese Lynch who's declared the victor. You can't discount the bodywork that Toltaev produced in the final round. Here's the verdict. Could well be split. And it's Rhys Lynch. What a wonderful moment for Scotland's Rhys Lynch. The 20-year-old from Faldhaus has gone through to the medal stages with a 3-2 split decision victory over Sir Natalie Toltaev of Kazakhstan. And Mike Keane and Craig McAvoy absolutely ecstatic with the spirited performance their man has just produced. He took the first round unanimously. Toltaev rallied magnificently to take the second round on a 3-2 split. But then Reese Lynch dug deep and found the quality to prevail on a 3-2 split decision victory at the conclusion of a very hard-fought contest indeed. He's absolutely delighted. He's through to the medal stages, a guaranteed 25,000 US dollars minimum but Reese Lynch will have designs on bigger prizes, such as the gold medal bout and the 50,000 or 100,000 that the silver and gold medalist receives. A terrific performance by Reese Lynch, eliminating Sanatoly Toltaev, the 2019 Asian bronze medalist, and there is confirmation. Toltaev crestfallen, Reese Lynch absolutely ecstatic. 
and Scotland from their six-man team have sent a boxer through to the semi-finals. A terrific performance.